You have absolutely nothing to worry about. Nse Ikpe Etim is one Nollywood actress that has exceptionally mastered the art of wearing different faces in movies. From the numerous characters that she has played in movies, one role we have come to love Nse Ikpe Etim in is that of a villain. The importance of villains in movies cannot be overemphasized as every beloved protagonist needs a great villain to exist and to entertain. But what happens when a villain is deliciously evil that the hero ceases to be the star of their own story? They charm audiences into rooting for them. We have rounded up three times in Seike Etim played the role of a villain and killed it. Number 1 as Ozzy in Quam's Money. Deals are not for just anybody. You don't call me just anybody. You're gonna call me for short. Olish Ome Quam. Mazman Notorious and Notable all over the world. 500, final offer. Do we have a deal? My guy, you are scammed. The 2020 movie Quam's Money brought back in Seipe Etim, who is one of the most Nollywood talented faces. To be led by a tall, beautiful woman. And then this woman defraud me. 500 million naira. Her character, Ozzy, in Kwam's Money is terrifying, and the role was beautifully portrayed, which took a soft approach. Ozzy, get me. And Seipe Etim did a great job at torturing fouls in the movie. Number two, as Mamba in Mamba's Diamond. If I don't have my diamond. In Se Ikwe Etim showed her villainous side again in this movie, playing the role of the deadliest crime lord the city had ever seen named Mamba. As long as your friend brings me my diamond in time. Her performance and exhibition of a villain with a certain calmness as well as ruthlessness in the William Uchimba produced movie was outstanding. Like Hello, ladies. My Guardian Angel. You make the biggest mistake of your life. The queen of the underworld's darkest spot. She carried herself every way one would expect a king pink shoe. Black Mamba is Satan. Have it close. If she catch me, are you? Oh God. The Black Mamba. Number three, as Jumoke Randu in King of Boys: The Return of the King. In your life, I will expose you. Ah! Her role as Jumoke Randu, the first lady of Lagos, in the hit movie sequel turned series, which was released on August 27, 2021 was nothing short of greatness as she showcased steadiness and her ability to immerse herself which contributed to bringing the character's essence to life. I ruined everything. You think you would have achieved even half of what you have today without me by your side? I am the one who has carried you over the threshold, you little living idiot. The only thing, the only thing you have successfully carried from your family is your last name. As a result of her character portrayal, Nseikwe Etim was greatly commended by anyone and everyone who saw the thriller series King of Boys Return of the King. And that will be all on three times in Se Ipe Etim played the role of a villain and killed it. Subscribe now to our YouTube channel Goldmine TV and be unleashed into a world of super excitement.